Welcome back. Okay, this is Aikido Flow. Okay, today I'm going to be talking to you about the frustrating times where I've tried to pull off an Aikido technique and it has failed me. So I had to go back to the dojo, see where I went wrong and correct my mistakes and practice, practice, practice. So today on Aikido Flow, we're going to be having a look at this. Okay, one time I'm working, running my little newspaper shop back in the days, must be, must be about 18 years old. My sister's ex-boyfriend, they just split up, he comes to me and he's in my face saying, tell your sister, blah, 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 blah. Now me, you know, I'm young, I think I'm a gangster, this guy's bigger than me, he's older than me, and I'd said, what, you get out of my face, you want to tell me something, you tell it yourself, blah, blah, F you, blah, blah. Now, that angered him. He came at me, he grabbed me, okay? And he slapped me. And he kept slapping me. Now, I grabbed his hand, I tried to perform a Nikia on him. It just didn't work. I was trying to rip his hand off my shoulder, it just wasn't happening. I should have pinned him to me, I should have moved my whole shoulder, moved my whole body, and then locked him down. I couldn't even use my hand to block the slap. This guy was bigger than me, he was older than me, I was feeling intimidated by him, and everything just went. It, everything changed when you're in a real life scenario. I felt like it failed me. Another time it failed me. I was working in a nightclub, central London, one very, very drunk guy. We bring him out of the club, trying to sober him up, leaning him against the wall. Now this is central London. There's a couple of guys surrounding this drunk guy. They're trying to go through his pockets, take whatever it is they can. So the friend steps up and he's like, what, what's going on, what's going on? What, have they got your phone? Have they got their phone? This angered them like, oh, what do you mean you've got your phone? Bro? You know how these young hood rats behave. The friend of the drunk guy and one of the hood rats start to go at it. One of the other hood rats tried to jump in, so I grab him and I tried to perform a kotageji on him. It didn't work. He just stiffened up and I couldn't move him. I couldn't move him at all, so I had to kind of do some flipping and change around and then basically grab him around his neck and kind of hold him back and restrain him. But my, my plan was to just take him down. I just tried to take him down using my strength. What I should have done is pulled him off balance first. Put my whole body into it. And when you're not familiar with a technique, you haven't practiced it enough, you just forget the real application of it. You forget the whole full body movement you should be doing. And that's what I didn't do. You know, when you're a martial artist, you want to you want to do these techniques, and it was, well, this is my chance to do something here. Let me show up with a coat to Geiji, but it just didn't work out. And once again, I was frustrated and annoyed with myself. I get a call on the radio. I need to remove this guy at the club. Now, me, I'm a man of words. I talked to this guy for about 10, 15 minutes, explained to him, look, you need to leave. Management want you out. He's going to call the police, blah, blah, blah. The guy's refusing point blank. It ends up with the guy giving a bit of a push. A bit of push and shoving goes on. I grab him. Now I lock him down in a move I can only describe as a form of Shionagi. But the guy suddenly just locked up. And I'm there trying to use my strength to take his arm down. He's using strength to pull his arm back. We were, well, neither of us were, were moving. We could, I couldn't move him, he couldn't move me. And now I understand completely why it didn't work. It's all about the circles, and that's what I failed to do. I talk about when Aikido has failed me. And in reality, maybe that's a bit harsh because I don't think Aikido failed me when I think about it. I think I failed Aikido. I didn't use the basic principles of Aikido. I didn't use the circles. I tried to pit my strength against other people. So, if you like what you see, please subscribe. Click, click the subscribe button was in the bottom corner. Make comments. We love to hear about your experiences where your martial arts has either failed you or even gone right. You know, we can learn from you as well. So, 
This has been Aikido Flow and we'll see you next time. Thank you.